Hello students, my name is Hridesh and you are watching my channel, Your Classroom at Home. If you really want to increase your mathematics skill, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel. In today's lecture, student, we will discuss about sets. Set is a collection of objects or elements. So, definition of set says, set is a collection of well-defined object. Well-defined object or we can say elements. For example, if we take a set A of first three natural numbers, it means A will equals to 1, 2, 3. Only three elements will be there in first three natural numbers. If I say first three natural number is 1, 2, 3, definitely from your sides the answer will be same. So it means these elements are well defined. Suppose if I take another set best five players in the world. So if you suggest the name of five best player according to your choice and I suggest best player according to my choice, the answer will not be same. So it means the best five players here cannot be well defined elements. The so best word ka lagna ya most word ka lagna elements ko well defined nahi karta hai. So it means ऐसे सेट्स मैस में सेट कंसीडर नहीं किए जाते हैं। Here we see that one belongs to A, two also belongs to A, three is also belongs to A. Here we see that four is not in the set of A. So we can say, sorry, three belongs to A. But 4 is not in the set of A. So, we can say 4 is not belongs to A. Here, this is a sign of epsilon, which is a Greek symbol, which indicate belongs to. Next thing in the set is, we can arrange elements in any order. For example, if somebody say set A equals to 1, 2, 3. And someone says set A, B equals to 1, 3 and 2. A and B here are equal sets. Since set A contain 1, 2, 3 elements and set B contain 1, 3, 2 elements. Arrangement of elements can be in any order in sets. So A and B are equal sets. The next thing in the set is repetition of word. Generally, repetition of the elements is not allowed in the set. For example, take a set of letters forming a word school. In a school, we see here double O is there, but in set, whenever we write these elements, then simply we use single O. S, C, H, O and L are the elements of set letters forming a word school. Important thing is to be noted here. I have written S in capital letter, A in capital letter, which indicate the set. Set is denoted in capital letter. Elements generally indicate you yeah, represent in small letters.
elements are usually denoted in a small letter the next thing is the method by which we can represent the set there are two main method one is roster form or tabular form in starting i have taken a set a equals to first three natural number in which all elements are separated by comma and enclosed in curly bracket is an example of roster form a is first three natural numbers one two three roast this is a roster form this set can also be represented in the form of set builder form set builder form means a equals to x such that x belongs to natural number and x is less than 4 so less than 4 natural number is definitely 1 2 3 so these are two ways by which we can represent sets so far student we have learned some basic points related to sets in my next lecture you will learn type of sets so continue keep watching my videos and keep focusing on your aim take care thank you